Decarbazine is an antineoplastic chemotherapy drug used in the treatment of various cancers, among them malignant melanoma, Hodgkin lymphoma, sarcoma, and islet cell carcinoma of the pancreas. Decarbazine is a member of the class of orchylating agents, which destroy cancer cells by adding an orchyl group to its DNA. Decarbazine is normally administered by intravenous infusion under the immediate supervision of a doctor or nurse. Decarbazine is bioactivated in liver by demethylation to MTIC, and then to diazomethane, which is an orchylating agent. It is on the WHO model list of essential medicines, the most important medications needed in a basic health system. Medical uses, as of mid-2006, decarbazine is commonly used as a single agent in the treatment of metastatic melanoma, and as part of the ABVD chemotherapy regimen to treat Hodgkin lymphoma, and in the MAID regimen for sarcoma. Decarbazine was proven to be just as efficacious as procarbazine in the German trial for pediatric Hodgkin's lymphoma, without the teratogenic effects. Thus Kupdak has replaced the former COPP regime in children for TG2 and 3 following OEPA. Side effects, like many chemotherapy drugs, decarbazine may have numerous serious side effects, because it interferes with normal cell growth as well as cancer cell growth. Among the most serious possible side effects are birth defects to children conceived or carried during treatment. Sterility, possibly permanent. Or immune suppression. Decarbazine is considered to be highly emetogenic, and most patients will be pre-medicated with antiemetic drugs like paulinostron or aprepetent. Other significant side effects include headache, fatigue and occasionally diarrhea. The Swedish National Board of Health and Welfare has sent out a black box warning and suggests avoiding decarbazine due to liver problems. Mechanism of action, decarbazine works by methylating guanine at the O6 and N7 positions. Guanine is one of the four nucleotides that makes up DNA. The orchylated DNA strands stick together such that cell division becomes impossible. This affects cancer cells more than healthy cells because cancer cells divide faster. Unfortunately however, some of the healthy cells will still be damaged. History Decarbazine was developed by Y. Fulmer Shealy, Ph.D. at Southern Research Institute in Birmingham, Alabama. Research was funded by a U.S. federal grant. Decarbazine gained FDA approval in May 1975 as DTIC Dome. The drug was initially marketed by Bayer. Experimental, decarbazine plus oblomersin. In clinical trials for malignant melanoma O1. Suppliers, Bayer continues to supply DTIC Dome. There are also generic versions of decarbazine available from APP, Bedford, Main Pharma and Teva. See also, melanoma, Hodgkin disease, ABVD, history of cancer chemotherapy. Orchylating antineoplastic agent. Notes. References.